Hi, good afternoon. This is Teacher Sevi. Uh, here I am again. I'm going to answer some of the uh, questions that Mark Marquez the children have sent me yesterday. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the first question is that what is the product of negative 4x5 y3 z2 times 3x cubed y squared z4? Mm -hmm. Now, for you to answer this kind of question, uh, remember the loss of exponents, okay? We're going to apply the, the, the rules and law on loss of exponents. Okay, the first one is like, you're going to multiply the numerical coefficients, which are the numbers, so negative 4 times 3, that is negative 12, okay? And then, if you're going to multiply variables with exponents, just copy the bases, so shall I say this is x and x, copy that x, and then add the exponents, just add the exponents when you're going to multiply variables with exponents, okay? So this is 5 plus 3, that is 8, okay? And then y3 and y2, so just copy y, and then add 3 and 2, so you have 3 plus 2, that's 5. And then copy z, z2 times z4, that is z6, 2 plus 4, okay? So our answer now here is negative x, a uh, negative 12, x8, y5, z6, okay? Okay, next question is that the sides of a triangle are 3, 6, and 8. If the largest side of the similar triangle is 16, what is the shortest side? Okay, shall we say this one is a triangle? And, okay, the, 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 this uh, drawing is not drawn to scale. Shall we say this one is 3, this is 6, and this is 8? And a similar triangle, naming this one, we have here 16. The question is, what is the shortest side? So this is the shortest side, so this one is just, look at this. 8 and 16, it is just multiplied, it is just multiplied it to 2. So this one is 6. And this one is uh, 12. 3 times 2 is 6, and then 6 times 2, that's 12. Okay, so there you go. The answer there is 6, which is the smallest side. Okay, next. What is the 30th term of the sequence 5, 8, 11, and 14? Okay, oh, sorry. So, we're going to find the 30th term of a given sequence, which is 5, 8, 11, and 14. Okay? So, we're going to find the 30th term. That means the 30th number of this sequence, okay? Now, as we can see, we have a difference of 3, difference of 3, and difference of 3. 14 minus 11, that's 3. Eight, uh, 11 minus 8, that's 3. And then 8 minus 5, that's 3. Okay, so since we have this kind of, this difference of 3, um, that means this one is an arithmetic sequence. When say arithmetic sequence, there's a common difference or common... Uh, a number that is added for each succeeding term. Okay, now, uh, arithmetic sequence has this formula, a n, which is the term, the number of terms that we're going to find, a1, which is the first term, plus n minus 1, which is the number of terms, and then the difference. Okay, so our a30, because we're asked, we're, we are asked to find uh, the 30th term, we have a30, a1 is 5, plus 30, our n is 30, so 30 minus 1 times the difference of 3, okay? So this one, our a30 is equal to 5 plus 29 times 3. 29 times 3 is how much? That is 87. So we have 5 plus 87. So this one, our a30 is equal to 92, okay? So the choices are like 92, 95, 87, and 84. The answer is 92, which is letter A. Okay? That's all for today. Uh, I'm going to take video soon with the other questions that he gave me. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just find Teacher Sebi. Good afternoon.